Good day! In this video, we are going to do question 3A of the 2019 NCA Level 2 Statistics Paper, Probability Method. So without further ado, let's try to solve this problem. At a school function or fundraiser, there is a dice game called Game A. The probability of winning Game A is 0 0.6. So in a dice twice, the player plays Ju earn 50 cents to take part and plays Game A twice. If a player wins both times, they receive $2. If the player wins only once, they receive $1. So the question is, what is the probability that the player received $2? To receive $2, they have to win both times. So in this probability tree, a win and a lose. The win is 0 0.6, a lose is 0 0.4 for the first attempt. The second attempt, again the same thing, 0 0.6 for a win, 0 0.4 for a loss, 0 0.6 for a win, and 0 0.4 for a loss. So to win $2, they have to win, win, and win, okay? So to calculate the probability of win and win, you just take a uh, probability of 0 0.6 multiplied by 0 0.6 and the answer will come up to 0 0.36. If you can answer that, you get a simple achieve for that question. Question part 2. What is the probability that the player will receive $1? To receive one dollar, he either win one and lose one, so there could be probability of win loss or probability of loss win. So to do that, we're going to calculate the win loss. So win loss is going to be here and here, zero point six times zero point four. They give us zero point two four, and then the other option is loss win. Zero point four times zero point six is also zero point two four, and you add them up together, the probability of we see one dollar mean one win and one loss is 0 0.48 again that will be another achieve okay now we look at the second part which is slightly more complicated but it's a merit question this time okay kim decide to play dice twice 100 times ju earn says that kim will profit by exactly 110 dollars what are the errors in ju earn statement Support your answers with numerical calculation. Okay, so if Juan, if Kim plays the game 100 times, he would expect to win $2, okay? Because 36 times, because uh, we calculated that in part A. So 0 0.36 probability times 100 will give us 30, 36 times. And that will give you 36 times 2 will give you $72. Similarly, if he win $1, it means that he'll win 48 times because the probability is 0 0.48. 0 0.48 times 100 is 48 times. 48 times the dollar, so you get $48. So total winnings will be 72 plus 48 will give us 120. But on the other hand, when he plays each game, he has to pay 50 cents per game. So he plays 100 times, so 50 cents times 100, they give us $50. So the total profit would not be 120, the total profit would only be 120 minus 50, that will give you a $70 profit. Also, another point to note that Juan cannot say that Kim will profit by exactly 110 because the profit calculated is only $70 instead of 110 and there is a chance variation in playing a game of chance. That is, if you play the game 100 times, many times, the chances, the profit figure will always alter, differ from 100 game to another 100 game. So that is why you talk about chance variation. If you can answer that, there's a merit for this paper and we'll do question 3B in the next video. Cheers everyone and have a good day.